welcome to our tutorial in this video we are going to so how can we add a report parameter in our report so for the better understanding we are taking an example of sales order so we we have sales order details table in this table you can see there is a order number is the relation key between order master and order detail where in order master we have a order number customer number region id sales person order date are the unique records but in order details we have order number is repetitive but order number is the item number is the unique so if we are making a relation between both tables then we can pull this kind of the data so what we are going to here we are going to show this data in a report and we will use a order number as a report parameter to show the report data so we are going to into we are going to in our demo environment and uh, we have a data set now i am going to uh, data source and a report so i am going to add a data set here data source and pick the query from here control c and paste the same into our report development environment it would be good if can if we can put the data set name here now you can see here we have all the fields okay and we are not using any report parameter here so what we are going to do here first of all we are going to show this data here okay now i am going to add a table here okay in a table we need uh, we are going to add one more column here and in the report in the table property we are going to assign the data set for the table okay now we have a data set okay and now we are going to add a parameter as a INP order number number okay there is no default value, no specify value, nothing we have. Okay. So we are taking a default value as a uh, copy. Order number 20170103 is the default value right now. Okay. Uh, we are going to specify value here. Control V and in a specify value we are going to here nothing delete okay now what we are going to here in our data set we have the report parameter if we are going to preview it would be like this okay now I am going to change my data set putting a where condition where Order number control V equal to the name of the parameter order number. Okay, now in a filter section, you can see there is a parameter name. So, 
we are we have added where condition in our data set now we are going to add header in our report so simply we are going to add above header so what should be the header in our report for example we need to show the uniqueness of the header details like this okay now we have item number repeat repeat columns order quantity base price and sales price now you can see here we have all the things right now okay so we are going to give a color okay now you can see here now we need the order number details something like that so there are some missing field like order number so we are going to add order number order date sales case case customer number customer sales person and sales agent for this what we are going to do here in the expression we are going to use order number same for order date same for sales case in sales case we are going to sum up total sales of the order so we are going to add a order number okay so in this section we are going to add a customer number sales person region okay now you can see here we have all the details like this so for a better understanding we are going to highlight this thing highlight this thing these are the header bold now you can see here we have all the stuff so now you can see here we have the parameter suppose if i want to change it it should be 2 and okay so what we are going to do here we are going to as a none none for the another product now you can see here these are details like order number order date so we have created parameterized order sales detail if we are going to pass one we are going to change the order number it would be reflect the same in our report so this is the very basic thing how can we add report uh, parameter in our report so I hope you are going to enjoy this video also and do the practice. Please subscribe my channel on YouTube. Thank you for watching us.